Hi guys, Anton here from Anton's Mindstorms Hacks. Here's a little hack I want to share. Yesterday I had fun with um, a NeoPixel circle um, that I connected to the breakout board here with just three wires and now I can connect um, the position of the pixel that is lit. I can of course light them all but for this demonstration it was easier to just light uh, one pixel and I made programmed it such that the hue is uh, I can control it with the right wheel here and the lightness um, I can control it with the left wheel so you can see this is a pretty dark blue and it goes up all the way to white um, I don't know what I'm going to use this for it was just uh, a lot of fun playing around with these pixels, changing the colors and making it react to uh, the motors. The way the code works is uh, pretty straightforward. So I have this glass here to talk to the uh, Wi-Fi board that I'm using to drive the pixels. And um, it's connected to port F on the hub. And I tell it to enter into a raw Python execution loop and then I can execute MicroPython commands um, on the board. So I tell the board to import NeoPixels, um, create this NeoPixel array on pin 4, which is the output pin there, and make it um, 12 uh, LEDs wide. And then in a continuous loop, I'm reading all the motor positions here that I'm using for my settings. Uh, for the U, the U motor runs with um, within minus 180 and 180, so I have to do a modulo function here to get a nice U between 0 and 360. Um, the lightness is almost the same, except that I want a number between um, 0 and 1, so I do the modulo and then divide by 360, so I get this number between 0 and 1. And then I have this function here to convert hue, saturation and lightness um, to RGB. I have the saturation always at maximum. And the lightness is of course controlled by one motor, the hue by another motor. And then I calculate the position of the LED to turn on um, with the uh, third motor. Um, actually the LED number one is uh, 90 degrees to the left of the motor so I have to make this little offset here and then uh, divide it by 30 because um, there are 12 LEDs and 12 times 30 is 360 and then I can execute these uh, micro Python commands here I tell the board to turn all pixels off first then I tell it to um, turn the right pixel so I'm formatting this one pixel with the current LED, turn it with the calculated color. Um, and then finally I tell the board to turn the lights on. Um, this whole thing is, you could say it's, it's a bit slow because I think it takes about 100 milliseconds to execute, a bit less, 70. And um, you can speed this up by running some code on the board, um, but I chose not to, to make it uh, simpler. Uh, I, the the Wi-Fi board now runs vanilla MicroPython and it's pretty easy to access it like this from the Spike Hub. And in the code above there is just um, here the class that does all the communication for you and um, I was playing around with two methods to convert hue, saturation and lightness to RGB. The full code is uh, downloadable as a project on my um, GitHub 
and um, I can't link to GitHub from YouTube, so I'll link to an article on my website. Um, if you enjoyed this, uh, remember to subscribe and I hope to show you more uh, in a few videos. I'm exploring um, ways to integrate these pixels into my models. Well, thanks for watching. Bye bye.